Hey guys, it's Warren here, and today we are making some proper comfort food. Inspired by our friends from across the pond, here is how to make a classic meatloaf. And this recipe is enough to serve eight people. To begin with, take an onion, slice the ends off, slice in half and peel, then take two peeled garlic cloves. Also take a handful of washed parsley, then finely chop these ingredients using either a mini food processor or a sharp knife. Then to a large mixing bowl, add these ingredients along with 500 grams of ground beef that's preferably 10% in fat or less. Also add two teaspoons of Dijon mustard, one tablespoon of dried oregano, 50 grams of grated Parmesan cheese, and one tablespoon of Worcester sauce. Season generously with some salt and pepper, then crack in one egg. And now it's time to mix all these ingredients together. Now you can use a wooden spoon, but for best results, it's best to use clean hands to make sure all the ingredients are thoroughly combined. And now next, take a loaf tin and line it with some greaseproof or parchment paper. Then take about 100 grams of Parma ham and line the loaf tin with each of the rashers. And if you find the loaf tin's too big, don't panic. Simply line as much of it as you need with the Parma ham so it can be filled with the beef filling. Then empty all the filling into the loaf tin and be sure to press it down so it's nice and compact. And then finish preparing your meatloaf for the oven by wrapping the Parma ham back over the top. And next you need to place your meatloaf into an oven that's been preheated to 180 degrees centigrade, which is 350 Fahrenheit. You then need to bake it for about 50 minutes until it's lovely and crisp on top. Also, when you're happy your meatloaf is cooked through, remove it from the oven, then take it out of its loaf tin and place onto a cooling rack to cool for about 10 minutes. And if you want, now's the time to use some kitchen roll to drain off any excess fat and juices as well. And then after the cooling time, simply slice your meatloaf into eight pieces and then it's ready to serve. And there you have it, that's how easy it is to prepare a delicious wholesome meatloaf, perfect for this time of year. 